Sir, this is not a road. Sir, this is a sidewalk. You, you, sir, you're confused. Turn this ship around. Sir, sir, <laughs> sir, what's in the cooler? What's in the, you have a Hello Kitty bumper sticker. Please explain. I have so many questions for you. Americans that have been killed and Latinos that have been killed and even poor white folk that have been killed. Hi, my name's Kenny. What's your name? I'm Sujin. Sujin, nice to meet you. Why are you here in DC? I'm here for an internship. Oh, nice. When do you start? May 16th. Well, do you liking it? Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah. Okay. What do you think is going on here? Some sort of protest or decoration of something, probably. Okay, so you didn't come out specifically for this? No. I will come out for a protest tomorrow, actually, though. Very nice. For what? It's called the Unity March. A bunch of Asian American nonprofits are hosting it tomorrow. Wow, intern that's very active. Thank you for your service. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. Nice to meet you. What's your name? I'm Shannon. Shannon, nice to meet you. Well, that's really close. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for talking to me today. Um, I appreciate it. How are you enjoying your evening out here? Uh, it's beautiful. I'm yeah. so happy to be here. Where are all these friends from? Um, we're all doing a summer internship together, actually. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. I just uh, I just met another intern up there. Um, like the DC summer thing, I guess. <laughs> no, absolutely. It is the summer. Random question. Is there a time when you've come like pretty close to death? You know, there is. Um, I studied abroad in Spain, in Barcelona, and I had kidney failure. And they, they don't speak Spanish, they speak Catalan. So I like walked myself, I feel like felt weird. So I walked myself to the hospital and I didn't understand anything that was going on. I like walked myself in and didn't leave for like two weeks. And I didn't know what was gonna happen. I didn't know anybody. I didn't know like if or when I was gonna leave. I didn't tell my parents. I like did not know what to do. And I think that was the closest I've been to death. No, that's pretty close. I, I think that's closer than I've gotten to death. But you're okay now, right? Yeah. Okay, that's good. You got healthcare, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> No, that's good. Thanks for talking to me tonight. You have a great evening. Thank you. You too. How you doing? I'm Kenny. I'm Ryan. Ryan, nice to meet you. You're out with uh, some friends tonight. Yep. <laughs> um, well, it's a beautiful evening. I was just wondering, what was the last gift you gave to someone and, and why did you give it to them? So the last gift I gave to someone was my girlfriend and I got her a mm -hmm. pair of pants. Nice. Where from? Uh, I think Aritzia. <laughs> okay. Nice. Did did uh, she like him? Yeah, she liked him. Yeah. How long have you been with your girlfriend? Uh, almost, I think two and a half years. Wow, dude. Yeah. Congrats. Thanks. That's uh, you know that's a long time. Yeah. Not everybody makes it to that to that stage. How old are you? Um, 21, almost 22. One of the beautiful evenings. One of the most beautiful evenings, uh, so far this summer. Not too hot, but. Uh, <laughs> Well, I guess it was hot earlier today, but I guess it's not too bad now, but thank you. I appreciate yeah, it. thanks. Take care, man. Yeah, you too. Hey, what's your name? Uh, my name is Samir. Samir, where are you from? Yeah, I'm from Afghanistan. Nice, nice. So you live in uh, D.C. now? No, no, actually, I'm living in Maryland. Yeah, in Riverdale. Very nice, very nice. Riverdale, nice place. Uh, you got some friends with you out here. It's a beautiful evening. Yeah, it's beautiful. Uh, beautiful. I like Actually, I like the Washington DC, the, the downtown and here. Does it get hotter than this in Afghanistan? Uh, sorry? Does it get hotter than this temperature-wise? Yeah, hot? the temperature is good, like same, uh, like oh, Afghanistan. Okay. It's not too much higher. All right. Well, I know you haven't lived here for a long time, but my question is, if you could get rid of a state, a single state in the United States of America, which one would it be? Uh, it would be Virginia because I love it. Oh. Okay. <laughs> well, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> That's where I live, so thanks for destroying my home. <laughs> I hope one day you experience the beauty of Virginia. Uh, for me, would probably pick Rhode Island, just because it's so small. Okay. Uh, I don't think it's worth it. But uh, maybe you'll get to Rhode Island one day, and maybe you'll agree with me. Okay, but I didn't see uh, that state, so when I visit that state, so maybe. Exactly, exactly. Hey, Samir, take care, man. Okay, Great you. talking with you. I Thank you. It. Good to meet you tonight. My name is Kenny. What's your name? I'm John. John, nice to meet you. Beautiful weather we're having. Uh, you enjoying your evening? Yeah. Well, my one question for you was, if I gave you $50,000 right now, and I said, go start a business, what would it be? What would your business be and why? Just open up a coffee shop. Okay, yeah. right. Do you like coffee shops? No, I just think it's like a fun thing to do, like wake up early, brew some coffee. I used to work at Dunkin'. It was like, the smell of coffee is really nice. 
simple, low stress. Yeah. You know, something fun. Do you uh, do you truly believe that America runs on Duncan? Yeah. Oh yeah, <laughs> for sure. Do you still get Duncan to this day? Sometimes. I like Sometimes their. Starbucks. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah. No. The the Northeast loves Duncan. Yeah. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you. Yeah. Take care, man. You guys on TikTok? Huh? TikTok? Are we in Narnia? Like, what's up?